Hello, Florida Tab Digger here. For Christmas uh, 2022, my wife and daughter bought me this uh, Johnny Morris Signature Series 50 year anniversary bait casting reel from Bass Pro Shops. I haven't put line on it and I'm not planning to. I'm just gonna keep this as is new in the box to, to have as a collectible. Uh, it's made with 11 Japanese bearings. Uh, they say it's a limited edition. Of course, they can only make it one year, being 50 years. So I guess that's limited in, it, in itself. But it's very light, very smooth. Now, I have uh, one of these Johnny Morris bait casting reels uh, from several years ago. Uh, basically, very similar to this, very light, and it's held up very well. So I'm very confident this would do as well. But I'm just going to keep it here in the box as a collector's item. And uh, they also got me the rod that goes with it, the Johnny Morris Signature Series uh, 50 year anniversary rod. Seven foot two. Uh, got, it says power hump grip. Um, let's see, quarter to five eighths ounce lure, line weight eight to seventeen pound, power medium, action fast, and appears to have a uh, nine or ten eyes. That's, there's one at the tip here. Let's see, we have one there. Yep, yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, not nine, ten eyes. Uh, that's really nice for a seven foot rod. Of course, uh, nine of them are really tiny right up against the rod, or eight of them, and then that one's a little, stands off a little bit more, and then this one stands off more. And it's got the trigger for being the, the casting rod. But yeah, it's super light. I'm going to keep it in the plastic. And I still have the cardboard tube that it was shipped in. So I'm going to keep it all uh, original and in the box. Maybe uh, another 50 years from now when they're having the 100th anniversary bait casting reel. My kids could probably sell this one and uh, make a little money off of it. Or keep it because... Just uh, something nice to have as a collectible.